name is Ashley Riemann. I work for Milestone Contractors based out of Indiana. I work in the Indianapolis location. Um, I've been in the industry for five years now. I've worked with Milestone for four of those, and I am a project manager in general construction. So my story is a little interesting. Um, I actually went to school for theater and so I went to school in Los Angeles and then I came back to Indiana and I was like what am I going to do? So I looked up like top paying degrees, the top 10 and actually construction engineering was one of them and I was like well I like to build sets and I like to do stuff like that so maybe I can get into construction. So I went to school for that and then um, actually I found a scholarship through APAI, the Indiana branch of APA and um, um, they gave me, I mean, there's so many scholarships out there in asphalt and you're bound to get one of them. So I was like, maybe I should stick in this industry and I have never left. I know everyone talks about the people, but like people think that like every construction person is just super rugged and super tough. And like, yeah, there are a lot of people like that, but there's also like, I mean, I see women out there with their nails done. I see guys out there wearing, you know, their like fancy clothes and stuff with their operators. Like, it's just so different groups of people. It's not all the same rugged, like you have to be a burly man, you know, like there's, we're all across the board and that really surprised me. My company, Milestone, is um, underneath Heritage, and Heritage is really into women in the industry. I mean, we have stuff in aggregates, we have stuff in asphalt, we have stuff in that, and they are a big sponsor of Women of Asphalt. And so through APAI, through Heritage, through Milestone, we all just came together, and that's how I got introduced to Women of Asphalt. It's kind of like inspirational, I would say, you know, like, I'm a young woman in the industry and like I've kind of made my own way but you, I haven't seen like a bunch of like older women yet but once I came to Women of Asphalt, I mean I saw people that are CEOs, people that are running their own companies, I mean even like operators that have been here for 30 years and I'm like you're so cool, like you're such an inspiration to me. I would say there's so many opportunities out there. I mean, you don't have to work out in the field. Like I personally like being in the field a lot, but I have also an office component to my job. We have project accountants that work with all the accounting. We have um, people that work in labs. There's just so many different things. If you even are in a complete different realm, you've never worked in asphalt, like you can take that and bring it to asphalt. And you will, I like to say, you'll always have a job you'll always have a way because you're always going to need a road and you're always going to need a bridge. So you're going to have that job security. I think it comes with representation because um, I will say it took me a minute to get comfortable just because I was like a young female out there. And then once I saw another female out there, I was like, okay, okay, I can do this. So it all comes down to representation, having those women in like, lower positions, higher positions, mid positions, like just all throughout the company. Because sometimes I find that there's women that are still in that lower, you know, podium, but they can get, they can get there. And so having that representation would really help. I would like to leave a legacy of a girl that has no idea what she's gonna do with her life, know that she will have a career and that like even if it's not something that she thought she wanted to do that just take that opportunity take that chance um, i'd love to see a lot more women out here just representing and it's i just would i could never leave the asphalt industry it's it's my home